Industrie 4.0 bedeutet. For Markilux, Industry 4.0 means an ever more intensive integration of modern communication systems with digital technology. We have the ability to make an ever quicker rate of change possible. There are many areas in production that could be automated along these lines. Most of the ideas come from within our own ranks. We work closely together with the colleges in the region as well. In the meantime, we have even set up a department dedicated solely to automation projects and their further development. We have slowly changed and grown from being a production facility based on manual labour to one that is increasingly industrialised because our customers want their products to be delivered to their house as quickly as possible. Well-organised automation processes form an essential part of that. A large part of our automation processes already take place in the technical cover manufacturing department. At the automatic cutting machines, the operator only has to scan in the order number for the machine to read in all necessary data. There are no cutting errors and no creasing or marking of the fabric. The improved handling systems have made a lot of processes much simpler. It is a similar story when we move to the automatic laser cutting machine. There the data is acquired from the making up room. Here we can cut triangular pieces of fabric, window openings and oversized materials to an accuracy of a couple of millimeters. In the case of our track fix units, we need to be able to produce covers to exact dimensions. These systems function with zips running through two tracks. To be able to make these efficiently, we came up with a table dedicated to the manufacture of these covers. It unrolls the cover onto the table, and when we then cut both sides and bond the zips to them, they fit exactly. The bionic tendon is part of the arm of a folding arm awning. It is a highly tensile and resilient component. The machine we use to manufacture the bionic tendons checks both the top and bottom threads for faults. Consequently, we are 100% sure that nothing is going to give way. When the cover is finished in the technical manufacturing department, it enjoys individual attention. The covers are forwarded to the assembly department. There, they have to be rotated through 90 degrees and raised and lowered by a couple of meters. It no longer has to be moved around between different holding locations. It is held in a large temporary stocking rack in which it is semi-automatically allocated to one of our storage tubes. We don't want to take up our employees' time with unnecessary tasks. The employees working for us have been with us for an amazingly long period of time and have the long acquired experience that goes hand in hand with that. We don't want to burden such valuable employees with carrying out transportation duties which are not absolutely necessary. We have started to automate processes in the metal cutting room. We have built a cutting end barrier which enables five profiles to be cut at once. The operator no longer needs to enter any values into the machine. There are no longer any unpleasant surprises as the cut lengths are now always correct. We have two robots working in folding arm production as these components have to be manufactured to the smallest margins. This means the drilled holes, milled surfaces and threads have to fit exactly. Our Cardex storage systems, which we have had in use for a couple of years, are highly automated. Prior to their installation, employees used to have to know the ins and outs of every component. Now the picked component is presented to him and even depicted on the monitor as well. This means we can use our seasonal workforce for this task, those who do not have in-depth knowledge. The last step is to pack the awning. As we have different awning sizes, we need different packaging sizes. To accommodate this, we have built a railway system in the basement so that we can pull the correct packaging size up to the packaging table with very little effort. There it is cut precisely to length. After packaging, we measure the weight. After that, the awning can be handed over to the haulier and transported to the customer.
Digital transformation brings a lifetime of learning with it. It is extremely important for the employees to embrace these new technologies, but it is just as important to involve the employees in these new processes at an early stage. It is paramount for us to utilize the experience of the employees in these processes and topics, so as to find the right approach as early as possible in the design stage.